pre-recorded sound and about ready to cut. Stereophonic space sound on the limited fluid sound box album. Here's a blank 16-inch acetate. It's a cutting engineer, Leonard Horowitz, who has cut every Dionysus record released since 1991. Right now he's cutting a... He's not cutting yet. He's about ready to cut a test groove. Make sure everything's in order. The West Trex 3D stereo cutting head. Twelve inch <clears throat> start mark. And that's the start mark for a twelve inch record right there. And this apparatus here controls the width of the groove. This machine is not computerized. Leonard does all this by hand. He figures out the width and depth of the groove by hand according to the deepness of the low end and the time and the time per side okay, he scrolled in, uh, he scrolled the lead in groove there you can see and is cutting the first song this tube sucks out the uh, Acetate as it's being cut away to form grooves, and it ends up in this little Tupperware container. Uh, this material is highly flammable. It looks like hair. Uh, Leonard checks the microscope. Make sure the grooves aren't touching each other. If they touch each other, it'll uh, cause the record to skip or stick. Better view of the cutting head here. This apparatus shows and controls the heat of the stylus. How hot did you say the stylus gets? Oh, it's red hot. It's about 180, 180 degrees. That's because there's 250 watts of sound going through this little cutting head. There's a good view. Song's over, and he's going to scroll the cutting head, which creates the island between songs. We'll be back for the last song on the side, so you can see the process of scribing the dead wax. Hope you enjoyed. <laughs>